Now our installation is complete. The next step is to program the module. So the light on the module will be red. First step is to take the key and insert it into the key port. We're going to let, wait for the module to start flashing green in sequence of one. The light on the module is flashing green. We remove the key and we wait five seconds. The light has gone back to red. We're going to insert the key back into the key port and wait for it to start flashing green rapidly, indicating that we're ready for clone. It's flashing green. Now we can proceed to the clone procedure on the computer. Now we've completed our clone, we've plugged the module back in, the light on the module is red. Now we're ready for the last step of programming. We're going to take the key, once again, and put it in the key port. The light goes green and out, indicating we're ready for remote start. Module is programmed, installation is complete.